decided to marry myself because from childhood I had this dream and I used to take vows looking at the mirror talking to myself that I'll be doing this I'll be doing that I won't leave myself but then this idea really got stuck in my head but I always thought I this is not possible in reality but when I grew up I watched a series and with an E and I heard one dialogue which says every woman wants to be a bride but not a wife and I wanted the same so I decided to marry myself uh, being a bride but not anyone's wife On the Haldi occasion, of course, just like everyone, I'll be wearing yellow sari. On Mehdi, because I am a bi-gender, I want to mix it up little bit with female and male orientations. I'll be wearing dhoti kurta just like men. And on my wedding day, I'll be wearing red chanya choli. This self marriage is self love. If you ask me in a sentence to describe why do I want to marry myself, it would be like I'm devoting myself to the self love for me which I have. So uh, I want to accept all parts of me: the body, the shame, the guilt, whatever uh, society says is flawed. I want to accept it as flawedly beautiful yeah. in a very beautiful way. So this marriage would be acceptance and accepting myself in complete way. Why can't I do that? That is completely possible. When I read about sologamy, that is a concept and it is happening all over the world. So many of my friends support me. They are involved as much as I am into the wedding. There are many friends who have asked me to wait for 10-15 days. I might change my mind. But I told them I'm very firm. It's already 10 days. Okay. So I'm going to tell my friends, if you're watching this video, I'm still there. I'm still marrying myself.